Hey, it's Young Grace from the Hidden Levels here with a achievement guide and a video preview of Fragments of Him. You may be wondering what what I mean by achievement guide and a video preview is that this is the first 15 minutes of the game, but it will also double as part one of the achievement guide uh, video series that I'll be doing for this game. I think it'll be five parts in total. I've already started the game, but let me just talk about the uh, the general stuff first. Fragments of Him is a sort of a visual novel. There's not much going on in terms of gameplay, but it is a very moving story. I actually recommend that you play through the game instead of watching the video. Uh, but if you like to watch the video, that's fine too. It'll get you the 1000 if you follow along to the video. Um, it is developed and published by Sassybot Studios, released on June 1st for the price of $9.99 US dollars or its equivalent in other regions. Just unlocked an achievement already. There's 10 achievements worth 100 points each. <coughs> They're all story progression except for a couple of them that you have to make a decision or do some stuff. Uh, I actually show the one missable here in during this part of the walkthrough video preview and towards the end is that uh, you have to make one or the other decision if you make one decision you miss the other achievement if you make the other decision you miss you know obviously the achievement that you did not go with so I get one and then I reload that scene and I get the other immediately instead of playing all the way through the game and then getting it at, uh, at the end I just like to get achievements in the order that they appear in, so that's what I that's what I do. Basically, you've already seen it's like you're playing as the main character. There's like four four characters in the game: Will, uh, Will's grandmother, uh, Mary, Will's girlfriend Sarah, Will's boyfriend Harry. You may be wondering <laughs> what it means to have a girlfriend and a boyfriend. Is that he's in college right now? He's experimenting with his uh, sexuality, that kind of thing. Something happens. You'll see in the end of this part that brings them all together. And the way the game is played, you just run and. You just run and press A on the outline of these things to see events happening. Yeah. Just your basic day-to-day day -day stuff. There's nothing like really special about what happens in the game. There's no like special powers that these characters use or anything like that. Uh, one thing that did bother me a little bit is that the loading time is fairly long in this game. I mean, the game is not that graphically intensive or um, anything like that. I don't know why it takes so long to load up a scene, but it does take quite a while. A uh, few times I thought the game froze. Turned out it was just taking a long time. Like right now, you see, it's taken like 30 seconds to load the screen. My walkthrough video is going to be all about loading screens at this rate because there's like 22 scenes that we have to go through and that means at least 22 loading scenes the entire video is about two hours long it's not very long so it's very easy 1000 if you like uh, getting gamer scores and just enjoying a um, good story there's only and it's $10, 2 hours, kind of like watching a movie, I guess. Right about there. So, yep, just doing your basic stuff like uh, dri starting to drive, you can walk. And you drive out of your garage. Game is, um, I believe, the Sassy Studios is in uh, UK. So, 
or the game takes place in UK. I don't remember, to be honest. Uh, I don't think they actually say where they're from. But because of that, some of the words that they choose to use are may not be familiar to you from uh, if you're from the US. But it's not a big deal. You can probably understand it uh, by you know, looking at what's going on. Like, well, it's definitely somewhere in you know, UK or Hong Kong or a place like that because the guy is driving on the right side. I mean, the person is uh, sitting on the right side, the uh, driving lane is on the left side. Uh, in US and uh, Korea where I'm from uh, we drive on the right side and the uh, driver's seat is on the left so we can tell that that's one difference so it's something that might not be familiar to you when you first start this So uh, I don't click it here. We do go through this scene one more time, exact same scene uh, later on. But you could have clicked that cafe uh, for a little bit more dialogue. Uh, there is, I believe, there is no way to die in this game. So feel free to do whatever you want. And the next thing that you have to do is pretty much highlight it and. So you really don't need the walkthrough, but uh, just in case if you get stuck and it's well, it's a, some more content for our uh, our channel. Feed the ducks this weekend. I love the way they walk. And not not really much to talk about. It's all about just. He's got to know how I feel about him. It's really day to day stuff so going on here. He's driving somewhere. We don't really. We are not told where. Now click on the guy, and something happened. We don't know what happened exactly, but something happened. And now we are going back in time a little bit. Again, a very long load time. I didn't want to edit these out because uh, I wanted to show you how long it is. Because I believe. Uh, Video preview needs to you know, represent what the actual games good and bad are, but not really. You no, know, this is not a full review of the game. So, but you know, if I edit those out, then you can't tell there's a long load time. And if you're one of those Patterns. people that hate games with long load time, like you can't stand it, that may sway your decision to purchase or not purchase this game. So. I didn't want to edit those out. For uh, future parts of this walkthrough, I may edit these those out. This isn't what I imagined or wanted. So Will just wakes up in his room, and uh, soon this is where the achievement, um, the decision has to be made. Will does go through uh, the same routine every morning, so he does all these things every morning. But does he want to change his routine? Change it up? This morning? It does not change the outcome at all. I mean, what happened in the car happens if you change your routine or not change your routine. But Harry likes me in this t-shirt. It it is uh it is for an achievement. Like uh, you get an achievement for changing the routine or sticking with the routine. There's one one for each. So. If I remember correctly, I believe I stick with the routine first, and when after I get the achievement, I go back and and then change my routine. Changing routine is to uh, go to the kitchen first instead of going to the bathroom. Not changing the routine is going to the bathroom first and then going to the kitchen. So here, turn left. And the bathroom is on your left, the kitchen is on your right, you see the door opening automatically there. The game just basically tells you where to go. It, it like guides you along. So this is the regular routine that you take. 
but if you decided to go to the kitchen area and got uh, made a breakfast for yourself first before going to the take a shower you would have gotten the achievement for changing up your routine marriage so that's exactly what I do after um, this scene ends in just a little bit we'll get one achievement and then we'll pause the game go to load game and load this scene back up and then we'll go through the exact same thing up to the point of going to the bathroom or the kitchen and then we'll run to the kitchen instead so here Yeah, another long load screen and then it will be followed by another long load screen because we're gonna be uh, doing a scene change yeah I'm definitely editing these out uh, I don't want to bore you again with like uh, 30 seconds of load time every few minutes I suffered through that I don't want I don't need you to suffer through that on a video you're gonna be ha if you're playing this game, you're gonna be um, staring at the load screen on your game, so I, uh, I don't need to keep make the video longer just because of that. Anyway, so I loaded the scene back up, and we'll be uh, doing the exact same thing, like checking the bookshelf, checking the alarm, uh, checking the portrait, and all that stuff, all that good stuff. And then you'll go out to the living room area and uh, the bathroom door will open. But instead of going to the bathroom, you will run to the uh, the kitchen area and make breakfast for yourself. And you'll get the other achievement and then end up in grandma's living room again uh, with Will as a young, young child. That will be part two. The way I want to break, I'm going to be breaking down this achievement guide is um, Will's section is part one. Grandma Sarah's, uh, sorry, not Sarah, Mary section is part two. Girlfriend Sarah's section is part three. And then there comes the middle section with um, some things happening. That's part four. Will's section, uh, Harry's section, uh, Will's boyfriend is part 5 and that concludes the game I think hold on let me just double check yeah that is the end of the game so well I don't I mean actually the game does not end with Harry's section but I, I will just end the whole walkthrough there with uh, Harry's section so that's it um as you see, I don't know how you feel about this game at this point. I enjoyed it. I finished, I obviously finished it as I have the full walkthrough recorded. I enjoyed the story quite a bit. Uh, it is a good uh, dramatic story. Uh, and uh, if you like that kind of stuff, I mean, if you are into like more action, like a uh, FPS, or something like that. That's not what you're gonna find here. You're gonna find the good story, something uh, that's moving. And, you know, kind of like reading a um, good novel or a um, watching a uh, nice drama on TV or something like that. So, with that, I am going to say my outro here. Uh, thank you for watching. My name is Singrius from the Hidden Levels. Um, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Check us on our YouTube, on our Twitch, on our website, www.thehiddenlevels.com. And I'll be back with next part of this achievement guide. Thank you. Husband and husband for the rest of our lives. I think. Maybe Grandma would be okay with it, these days. Uh, then again, maybe she wouldn't. <laughs>